My name is Nicole Jones. I'm from Arizona State University. I'm a golfer at ASU, and I play violin. Violin, at this moment I saw it, it was a love of mine. Uh, it started in kindergarten, actually, in Minnesota. My friend, Sarah, she actually picked it up before me, and she decided to play it for class one day. And I saw it, and I'm like, ah, oh, I want to play too. So I picked up the violin and I just fell in love with it right away. I started playing golf uh, my freshman year of high school. My grandma actually got me into the sport. The main reason I started playing is because she bet me $200 that I could not beat her. And um, $200 to a freshman 14-year-old was good money. So I decided to pick up my clubs and go hit the links. It took me about three months of just straight practicing, and I ended up beating her on the course. My grandma's an avid golfer, so she played basically every day, and she hits it 200 straight, 180 straighty actually. <laughs> That's what we like to call her. Violin and golf, they pretty much go hand in hand just because of timing and your swing, and you need to be calm. Uh, I used to have the problem my freshman year of I literally practiced this really intense, like Barbara Seville, but it's a really fast-paced song, so if I get that stuck in my head, my swing automatically goes like out of the roof. I'm swinging like 100 miles an hour. So music and tempo and golf go hand in hand. I think it's really important to understand rhythm uh, for the sport because rhythm changes everything. I think my passion for golf comes from me being passionate about winning and me being passionate about achieving my goals because golf, you have to have lots of little goals you have to achieve. So every week is something new, whether it's you're doing better at your three footers this week or next week, you're gonna have a straighter drive. My success kind of snowballed. It wasn't until my junior year when I decided I wanted to go play at a university. And um, at first, like I said, I did it for fun. And then it just became a love of mine, just like violin and after then, everything just kind of fell into place as the harder I worked, the more I achieved. In May, after I graduate, I am going to go try to go professional. I want to go play overseas, possibly the European tour, some of the mini tours over in Europe, and travel and just live my dream. I love violin, but the second you make it something that's more like your job, I didn't want to lose my love for it, but golf, I could easily, I love it and I enjoy it, and I could easily make that one my job. As music, I want to keep that kind of to myself, and it's like, it's like my holy grail. <laughs>